I got Meta Knight. Um, use. Oh, did I remember to turn down all the sound? Let me see. I'm checking some stuff. I don't think I have the audio going to the right thing. I don't. Let me fix that. Let me grab my headphones. Because then I won't be able to hear the fun music. There we go. Okay, you guys ready for some Kirby? And anyone's free to join, um, add me if you want. Yeah, maybe we will be able to. Okay, good. All right, let's do this. Uh, wild mode or spring breeze mode? A lot of help for this adventure. Perfect for those who are new to action games. I'm going to get this one. Um, I think Kirby just had got more mutant powers. All right, so let's play. Um, you know what? I'm gonna go to this side of the screen. Cause I'll be looking over here. I don't know why I keep closing my eyes. Why do I do that? I need to stop. You know what? Hold on. One moment, everybody. I'm gonna put this right here. There we go. Sorry, Kirby. Okay, let's do this. Uh, let me move this tablet. Oh, I got my tablet in the way. Uh, sorry, one second. Hopefully that looks okay. Uh. All right, let's play some Kirby. So I have been excited to play this game, and huge thank you once again to No Hitter, who's the reason I get to play it. I'm just really sad we couldn't do co-op, because Nintendo originally announced this as online co-op, and apparently it's not, which kind of sucks. It does.
So everybody likes Kirby. Another mode is co-op. Well, apparently it's only couch co-op. So, like, when you're here first, we can play it together. Well, I need to buy another controller. Unless you bring your controller. I don't get to turn into beast mode? That's one of my favorite cur- Is anyone else really like- Remember the beast, um, transformation and the whip transformation? I kind of miss- I miss those two. I wish they brought them back. Kirby, uh, Kirby, he got a few pounds on him. It's okay. He chunky. As Square limited time available DLC on Chocobo Racing Game. That's weird. I still need to pick up a PlayStation Network card to pick up some DLC. I'm probably gonna do that after the stream. Unless somebody forced it makes me send me. No, don't send me. Oh, sword! Let's go get Link. Oh, you can't shoot the, uh, the energy. Kirby, charge it. So I, I love Kirby. In all reality, I, I have, I have loved Kirby for a very long time. It's one of my favorite series. Don't do it. So I'm gonna buy a hundred dollar one. Because the two DLC I want is like 40 for one and it's one for another. <laughs> but don't do it. You do enough. But yeah, I I'm actually glad we got a new type of Kirby game. Like, I am glad they're trying different, like, how Laboratories is trying different things. But apparently they're also still making other games, too. Part of me wishes eventually we had Nintendo games on PC, but another part of me kind of understands that Nintendo knows what they're doing a lot of times with certain hardwares. Like the Wii U had, had they put like a thing to play the 3DS games on there, I think that game, that would have been a huge success of the system. I think that was kind of like a, a miss for them. But the Switch has been a lot of fun, and I'm still really grateful to to um, Diago who sent it to me. And I need to, I want to get like the O L O O L E D system. But watch, with my luck I'll buy one and then they'll totally bring out um, the Switch Pro people have been talking about for years. Yeah, I do wish Nintendo would learn how online. Oh, it's louder than me? Is it? I'm sorry, no one told me. Can I, I can't change it here? Okay, let me change it here. Hold on. Is that the OLD? Is the poor poor quality screen? Is this better? Audio-wise? Okay, good. Thank you. The mar Yeah, the marketing didn't help either, but like I said, I really wish... Because I liked my, my uh, Wii U, but you couldn't buy like parts for it to repair it and stuff like that. There was a lot of issues with that system. Um, I have mine safely in the storage unit. I'm pretty sure. Oh, thank you, Jordan. Is great, and the UU had a lot of motion blur. Oh. I might get the OLED because then, because I like to take my Switch with me a lot of places, and since it's my streaming Switch, I might just get the OLED for, you know, when I'm out and about, because I don't want to ruin my Switch for traveling, or for uh, streaming. That is creepy. Kirby realized that day he done fucked up. <laughs> I just looked at the chat and somebody goes, oh, I don't like it! I don't like it. So I guess this is after mankind's been destroyed in this part of the world. He's got the look, 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 he's got the little link hat on. That didn't do that in the uh in the in the demo. Are you a unicorn person? 
A lot of people have asked that about me. I'm a toon. I'm a cartoon character, so I guess you can call me that. I'm not one of those furry things because I don't have any fur on me. So I'm a cartoon character, like a Looney Tune. And I'm going to stop using that voice because it's really annoying me. I don't know about you guys, but that gets really annoying. Also, sorry about if I sound a little scratchy. I think it's allergies. got to be a million different forms that they've made Kirby for this game. They, mu they must have had a lot of fun coming up with forms for this. Help us Kirby discover more. Oh god, no! These are clean, fun screens. No dirty. So this is the new cars. From Pixar. I hope you guys like it. It's a little creepier than their last one, but they wanted to go a little avant-garde. Oh, you can in the demo? What would you say your favorite game is? What do you mean, though? Are you talking about, like, Kirby or, like, in general, or...? Wait, Waddle Dees make a noise? Since when have Waddle Dees made a noise? I know what the... I used to the... I... This is the only thing I, I have to complain about with gaming. Could everyone have, like, universal buttons for the controls? Like, all the buttons are in the same spot, you know what I mean? That would be really, really helpful, I think, because you get so confused. Maybe that's just me. Oh, give me a second. I almost forgot to do something, and I don't want to forget. Now that goes in. There's the thing. There's the thingy, my bobber. Oopsie. I should have grabbed a drink. Oh, in general, uh, I really like horror games a lot. Um, but I also like cutesy games. In fact, we have a goal right now on on uh, Twitch. If we hit 200 subs, we're going to do a really cutesy game with Mike. Oh no, you don't. That thing is too cute. You know what? I kind of wish I had gotten the coin purse that they had it targeted for me. It's so cute. 
Got it. Fear my wrath. Things you are you're fighting are pretty cute too. Yeah, they are. I love it. I love the design work in Kirby games. Yay! <laughs> Sorry, I like I missed the Kirby dance. Because in the Kirby Kirby class that we have been playing, you really don't see it that much. You, thanks for saving me. But what about those other guys, the Waddledees? They were all captured and taken away. We fought those beasts so as hard as we could. But they kept coming back for more. Now I'm the only one left. What are you? I have to go save them. I have to. What are you? I've never seen you in a Kirby game. What? You'll help me save everyone? That's great. So your name is Kirby? I'm Elf... El... 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 El El nice to meet you. Oh, <laughs> you can spin him around. See, this is the part is what made me think it was online co-op. But from what I read online, it was supposed to originally be. Hey, Kirby. I'm going to use my regular voice for Waddle Dee. Co-op with two players. Yeah, you're right. It does seem like it would be. Boy, am I glad to see you. I got pulled through that vortex planet pop star 2 over planet pop star 2 if you ever want to see a second player to join you i would love to game by the way thanks to shadow wolf for checking that for me but i'm going to show you guys right now it is couch co-op only that is gay nintendo needs to learn we want to play online with our friends Oh, I haven't put the codes in yet. Um, can everyone send me the codes? Or DM me on the- on the Discord with them? This is why I have to stop and think before I press X. Yes, that is exactly the- that meme is so spot on. I get so confused when I press buttons on controllers because of this. It should be all in Black Watch, right? Let me just go over the Black Watch. I can't find Black Watch. Shoot. Shoot monkeys. Where's Black? Somebody ping me and there it is. Never mind. I'm a spaz. Where are they? They didn't put it in Black Watch like I asked them to. Also, for those wanting to use channel points, I, I've got to make emotes for it first. It won't let me do it unless I make stupid little emotes. So give me some time to resize some images. You'll have, you'll have it by tomorrow. No one wants the bunny. Oh, I'm sorry, little buddy. Got it. I'm trying to still commentate, but I can't really think of much to talk about. I just want to enjoy Kirby. I saw some online news thing call this a, Ma a Super Mario Kirby, and I can kind of see what they meant by that. No track. This is creepy. <laughs> right, Force, you haven't seen this yet, have you? You didn't see the demo. Yeah, 
We had 69 cans. You're really going to kill the foxes? I have no choice. I don't want to kill the little foxy foxes. I love foxes. It gets more cursed. Gotchas! Love gotchas. Those and those crane machines. I'm usually actually good at them. Last time I played a crane machine, I actually won um, a Pokeball. Like a little plushie of a Pokeball. Aww. Me. I might get you for that. People say the, the Switch has bad graphics. I think this looks fine. You sent via DM. Thank you. There was one a poo put in the Discord yesterday, but I don't know it. Somebody's gotta have to ping him. I'm not gonna use bomb. Go away, bomb. I never really like bomb. Oh, I wonder if Ninja Kirby's in this. I love Ninja Kirby. I wonder if I can get Ninja Kirby. I don't know why. I don't know why this exists. It's just so weird. Huh? I actually got, um... So, No Hitter sent me this cute little Meta Knight plushie, which I love. And I also have... I found the 30th uh, 30 year anniversary Kirby plushie at Target. I got the last one. I'm so happy. <laughs> it's so big and fluffy. And huggable. It gets worse, worse, it gets worse. Kirby's insides just don't exist anymore. I don't think he has insides at this point. I'm starting to think it's true that he's just a black hole. A sentient black hole. Yeah, I guess this is Earth after mankind is dead. Like, it's been destroyed. No, Kirby, you're supposed to be able to get up there. Wow. You really can. Poor Kirby. There we go. Gotcha! I wonder if they just keep using the same Kirby sound effects, like the, the voicing that they used when he started talking. This is Earth post... Nope, not reading that. I don't want to get political, sorry. Bye-bye, bunny. Oh. You're big. Booty shot! What are you doing? 
doing? Oh. How do you hold a sword and have gloves like that? I have questions for you, sir. I have a lot of questions for you. No, get rid of that. I want his thing. There we go. Got sword back. He wasn't that hidden. Don't care though. Bird, jet, plasma, wrestler. Yeah, there are a lot I'd wish come back. I like the little animations when they're far away. Like you can see the limitations of the switch when like things are far away from you, but it's it's fine for me. I don't mind it. Because, I mean, I, I, every system's going to have limitations, let's face it. See, like, look at when that thing's far away. Like, I don't mind the limitations for this system. I don't know why people are so obsessed with, like, that it's bad that systems have limitations. I don't think it is. I mean, it's not going to be to the level of a PC. I don't think any system is. But I think the Switch is fine. And now to get Doggo. If anyone plays Elden Rings, you know what I mean. I didn't miss anything. Nope. Good. That hat, though. I know it's so cute, isn't it? It looks like it's crocheted, too. I think that's the word I'm thinking of. I don't really know a lot of sewing terms. I'm sorry. I don't actually know how to sew. Oh, he killed himself, okay. Get another bottle bee. Hey there, Mr. Turtle. Ooh. Bad Mr. Turtle. Thank you, Mr. Turtle. Guinea pigs would like that. They love corn. Can you do that again, Mr. Turtle? You don't wanna? Okay. I'll oh, take care of it. Thank you, Mr. Turtle. I'm an idiot. Ignore me, Mr. Turtle. And we are just straight up murdering everything. All the waddle -dees. I thought there was a di I thought there's waddle -dees and there's another one, right? There's another one other than waddle -dees, isn't there? Waddle-doo. Okay, so there's waddle -dee and waddle -doo. Cyclops is the waddle -doo. Okay, I thought... I always get them confused. Nope, my... I am named Lily. Purity Sin's just the channel name, but m my name's Lily. Just like the other one's name is Suka. And we have a new girl that's gonna show up. Bandana Waddle Dee was pulled through the vortex along with Kirby. When he heard that his fellow Waddle Dees were being captured by the Beast Pack, 
He grabbed his trusty spear and ran to help. He can join you. Aww. Bomb. Oh, look, there's so many of them. Your figurine collection is now available to view. Good night, Ned. Have a good sleep. It's okay, you can call me Purity Sin, though. I don't mind it. Yes, unicorns are very good at murder. People don't even realize it. They keep sacrificing their virgins to us. They don't know what we're doing. Ooh. Fire. Sweet. I wonder if I can walk in my own flames. I can. Oh, I like the new thing for fire. That's neat. Yay! Coin, coin, coins. Hello, little fire bro. Guess what I'm gonna do to you? Everything burns. Oh god! It's a good thing Kirby can fly. Um Oh my god. No. Another Waddle Dee is mine. An atomic bomb to swallow? That would be an interesting Kirby. Over here? Okay. Always look for secrets. I love the music, the way they're doing the music in this. Bet you I can like this. Yep. So I gotta get four lanterns. Okay, I can do that. What the hell are you? Oh, you're the spiky thingies! Wow, you did not transfer well into this game, did you? Careful, it's gonna get me killed. There we go. And another gotcha. Mine. Atomic Bomb Kirby, yeah. Thinking about it, that's probably not gonna happen. Maybe Godzilla Kirby could happen, though. Speaking of, I can't believe I called another thing God uh, the Godzilla vs. Power Rangers. That was something I made a joke about months ago in a stream. I swear I didn't know they were making an actual comic out of it. Oh no, come back here. Mine. Mine, 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 mine. Oh god! No, you ass! 
You deserve that death. Go down, please. Thank you. Go up, please. Thank you. Got one more to find. Bet you get a fine. Yep. Ooh. Rice ball. Yummy. Rice ball. I missed it? Oh, I'll go back and look for it. I should have grabbed my drink. I should go and get it. I'll get it during the next break. Because I have some lemonade. Let's see, where is it? Where are you, Mr. Light? Where did you hide? Are you sure I missed it? It's at the very beginning? Okay. Go down, please. I got that one. I don't see it anywhere. Are you sure I missed it? In the very beginning? Oh, before this, I'll have to come back and do it then. come back and do it another time. I'm not going to try to 100% this game. That would take way too long. Doesn't Kirby kill Waddle Dees? I think he does when they're working for King Dedede. And King Dedede sends him. I know he kills Waddle Doos. I think he kills both. I don't think he does it anymore so much, though. I think that was just like something they used to do with the games. I'm doing okay, how are you? I just finished cleaning the guinea pigs cages and all that fun stuff, so I'm doing pretty good. I know this trick, I remember this from the original Kirby. Yep. thirsty. Here we go. I had something yummy to drink. Hey there, doggo. Bye there, doggo. So, um, late April, I probably won't be streaming much next month, uh, toward the end of the month, because my friend's gonna come visit me. And uh, we may stream together a little bit, but I'm gonna be spending most of my time with him, because I don't get to see him very often. In fact, I have to find the presents that I got him for a couple Christmases now. Oh my god. That's actually horrifying. Jesus. <laughs> what? If you added horror music to Kirby, it would work. I'm just saying, go get some horror music and play this game. Get some Silent Hill music? No. Why is everything so stretchy?
That is just weird. I'm glad this game did arrive on time. Can't believe I literally was just leaving the um, P.O. box when this arrived. I'm so glad my P.O. box people. What was funny is I walked into the P.O. box, right? And I haven't been there for a couple of weeks because of um, just, I live too far away now, so I only go when I need to. Um, I got yelled at by my um, P.O. box person for not visiting enough. Cause she, she loves like the comic book and she loves seeing Miko and stuff like that. And she scared the shit out of me. She keeps forgetting I don't like yelling. It scares me. Oh man, I'm gonna have to reset that. Okay. So, that's good. Um, so I, I, again, I look like I wanted to run out of the PO box. She's like, like apologizing for it. She keeps forgetting that I don't. But it was, it was funny. She yelled at me for not, um, for not visiting. And I'm like, well, if I get sent more packages, I'll come more. The more I'm sent packages, the more I visit my P.O. box. Oh. Okay, so we gotta... Whoop, no, come back here, you're mine. No, I need... Oh, this is going badly. Hmm. So that won't work. Give me back my waddle. Thank you. I wonder if you can combine abilities in this, or if they've just given up on doing that with Kirby. The poster for an archive? Oh, I missed it. I'm sorry. That was my own. I'll have to go back and do that. I'll go. I might come back to this level and do everything that I missed. Okay. I'll come back to this later, I promise. Bye-bye. See you, it's epic. Have a great day. Uh, well, can we put in the codes in now? Or, I thought you couldn't put the codes in yet. Oh, Waddle Dee Town. Okay, you can go to Waddle Dee Town. Let's go to Waddle Dee Town. I'll put in the codes. anymore. I don't remember seeing it since Kirby 64. I remember the very first Kirby game. Also, fun fact, if you ever look at the um, the boxes for Kirby in America and Kirby in Japan, Kirby always looks angry in America and Kirby always looks happy in Japan. All of these are rebuilding their town. Save as many as you can to open up new buildings and helpful resources. What of these cinemas now open? Rewatch some memorable scenes on the big screen. That weird word. Yeah, I still don't. At least I found the other wildies. It looks like they've arrived in this new world just before me. I was searching high and low for our friends, and then I saw the odd pink car dash by. I'm guessing that was you, huh, Kirby? That looked like quite a mouthful. Everything okay in there? Don't bite off more than you can chew. Yeah, they just stopped questioning. I'm sorry, Waddleby. I didn't mean to do that. It's 
a maxi tomato. I really need it, but I'll take it anyway. I actually had a pin of uh, Kirby with a with a maxi tomato, and I dropped the pin off of my bag, and um, so a lady found it, and she was telling me how she knew what it was because her her daughter really really loves Kirby and is a young kid. So I ended up giving the the um, pin to her to give to her daughter. Okay, so where do I put in the codes? I don't think I can do it yet. Yeah, I don't think I can do the codes yet. What happens if I use an amiibo? Oh, okay. Let's see. That was my Meta Knight. I kind of wish I got, like, a Meta Knight costume. You can't yet. Okay, then we'll go back to the world. Muddled D just the king and started building their own town. Yeah, I mean, wouldn't you? I love King Dedede. He's one of my favorite characters because he's so derpy. But, I mean, wouldn't you just give up and stop following your king at that point? Because, I mean, he's kind of... King Dedede's kind of, um... King Dedede. That's, that's how I describe King Dedede. Actually fun. Let's see if I can do it. Mine now. I love the detailing on like look at Kirby's look 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 at Kirby's hat. I actually really like the detail work they've done. No, you're fine. You're fine. A little side tracking is absolutely fine. Originally, Kirby is the book color of magic and the unseen horror. He's an eldritch abomination, but he's a good one. Unlike, you know, Suka, who runs the streams. She's a bad one. We just let her be here because she can do terrible things. I mean, that's one way to do it. Thanks, SOB. Before. This is from an older Kirby game, isn't it? Or from something? I know I've heard it before. Got it. Hey, dead man. How you doing? Put on Bayonetta Amiibo and put get high heel gun. You're assuming I have a Bayonetta Amiibo, Forrest. I wish I did. 
I also don't typically open my amiibos, actually. I, I opened my, my, my King Dedede and my uh, Meta Knight. And I shouldn't have. I feel bad for opening them. Rocky Rollin' Road. No longer mint on card. Yeah. I'm not really big on that kind of thing, honestly, as a collector. But, I don't know. Amiibos I don't always open. I actually like the cards, so I usually just display them. I have a Ryu Amiibo, and I have no idea how I got I bought you! I bought you Ridley, and now that you don't want it, I have a Ridley Amiibo. He's safely in a box, though. This is why sometimes I tell you the presents I buy you. Like, I, I gotta find your, um, your, um, Mega Man and get him ready to give to you, finally. The Mega Man statue that I've been holding for, like, a couple of years now. Fuck you, dog. What art? Ooh, can I get gun? Wait a minute, can I get gun? Oh my god. He's packing. He packing. Kirby finally had enough of your shit. I'm gonna go shoot King DDD. No, I won't hurt King DDD. Again, I kind of like King Beauty because he's one of those dirt villains where he's not really a villain, he's just kind of stupid. I don't really know how you would say it. Oh, fuck me. Out of here, Sonic. Kobe. Ridley, I didn't know they made- they made an amiibo of him! Yeah, I actually found it on clearance and I bought it for my friend, and he has one already, so... Unless he wants the second one, I have a free- I have a free amiibo. I like shopping for my friends, and whenever I see something that I know my friend Force would like, I usually pick it up for when he comes and visits. And don't go buying me shit just because I've got you shit. This is stuff that I've been holding for you for a while. The- the- the, uh, Mega Man is something I definitely was happy to get for you. I can't wait to see your face when you see it. I'm hoping it's here and not at the... At the... Find it. Ha! Ah, Y'all thought I was gonna get squished. I actually could never find the Sonic Amiibo. That was one of the ones... Mewtwo and Sonic were the two Amiibos that I kind of wanted to find. That and Lucario. I couldn't find that one either. Back when they were out. Like, God, I could never find them. And I tried really hard to find those. Just could never find them. And the Bayonetta ones. Dang it. I got the Joker Amiibo from Persona. Get out of here. Where do I shoot from up there? How do I get that? Can I aim shoot? Oh, you can. Okay, cool. Oh my god. Well, I wasn't expecting that from Kirby. Too many price hikers buying them. Yeah, that's that's one of the problems with Amiibos. When I see one and I really want it, I will pick it up, usually, but I don't get that lucky because we have a lot of psycho people here that like to, like, look for shit. Uh, what do you call them? What do you, the word escapes me. What are they called? Um, shoot, what are they called? Um, gougers? Not, uh, there's another word for them. They buy them up and they sell them like on Amazon, on eBay and stuff. Are you single? I'm not. I have a boyfriend. You guys know him. It's Weaponized Nerd Rage. We've been dating for, I think it's going on two years now? Yep, going on two years now. Maybe three. We don't keep track of that.
fake hustlers. Scalpers, that's the word I'm looking for. Scalpers, thank you. Um, we have a lot of scalpers here. In fact, I've told the story. I was at um, Walmart one day with Miko, and they had these, uh, you know fig pins? Those like little pins that are popular now with characters? They had a fig pin of um, Jubilee, and it was a shiny one. And I thought that was really neat, so I grabbed, you know, I grabbed it, because it, you know, I figured, I, I have a couple friends that like Jubilee, I can give one, I can give it to somebody. I didn't know it was rare, I thought they all would look like that. Well, this dude was like digging through the fig pins next to me, you know, just digging through them, and he saw me pick it up, and he goes, that's mine, and he tried to grab it from me. And, um, I, I screamed, I'm not gonna lie, I actually got scared and I screamed. And one of the, um, this lady that worked at Walmart came over, and, like, she kicked him out. She kicked him out of the store. She threatened to call the cops. She was really nice. Like, this this old... She was, like, an old southern lady. Really nice. But it was, like, she was going insane looking for this thing. And I just picked it up out of the pile. I, I didn't know it was rare. Somebody told me later on that it was a rare little fig pin. But he was, like, he was so mad at me for finding it. Like, that that's how scalpers around here act. If it was yours, your hand would have been on it. Yeah, exactly. Like, it, I don't know how we didn't see it. It was sitting in the pile. I just, I picked it up. I thought it was neat. I'm like, oh, hey, it's Jubilee and it's, it's sparkly. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna buy it. Yeah, he got pinned, I think, from that store, too. It was like one of those, and I hate to say it was one of those, um... I, do, I, I hate to say, I hate the stereotype, but he was like one of those, like, stereotypical neckbeard types. Um, but yeah, it was really creepy. He was, like, even Miko was starting to get her hackles up. Because she doesn't usually act vicious and stuff. But she was getting her hackles up at that guy. Maybe just an overeager collector. Like, here's the thing. I have picked up rare stuff at stores before. Like, I picked up, let, like, let's say I, I pick up the last figure. And I've done this before, and there's like a little kid that wants it. Or there's a mom that, that's looking for it for her kid, and it's, you know, in the back of the shelf, and I grab it, and she's like, oh, you know, I was hoping to get that for my son. I don't mind giving those stuff to people, like, you know, handing it to them. If you ask me nicely, I usually hand it to you. Like, I don't mind, because I figure I'm going to go get it, you know, I'll, I'll find another one somewhere else. Like, that type of thing, right? But if you're going to act like a child like that, then I'm keeping it. Q, I'm just doing it on principle now. And like he was going full on psycho mode. He grabbed my arm. He was screaming. Like it was, it was actually scary. I've never really had that happen at a store before like that. It was legitimately scary for me. I didn't know what he was going to do to me just for a fucking pin. And I even said it to the lady. I'm like, hey, and he heard it. I'm like, if, if he would have just asked for it, I would have given it to him. And she goes, no, 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 darling. I'm gonna, he's gonna be leaving the store now. He's gonna be leaving the store with nothing. You know, he wanted to argue with her, but she's like, no, you'll be leaving right now or I'll be calling the cops on you. I believe what you did was assault, which it is. Yeah, he would have been arrested. Oh yeah, no, definitely. He put his hands on me. If, if I had yelled for the police or if she had actually gone, you know, if he hadn't left, she would have called the cops on him full on and it I it would have been fine I would have had no problem with that because he touched me and I do not like like in real life I don't like people touching me I don't like anyone unless I'm used to you don't put your hands near me like it was like what the fuck dude it's a fucking pin and I believe I actually put a picture of it and put the story up on uh, Instagram too it's like Dude, it's a pin. You can find another one. Or ask nicely. Don't be a child over it. I've had kids who are more, more mature than this guy was. Yeah, no, the, it was also that that's the Walmart ever since I moved here. We only have one Walmart in town, so I always go there. So people know me, like, the workers know me because they see Miko and she's usually in, in wearing a costume. And they say hi and stuff like that. So I'm 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 very quiet in stores and stuff, unless I'm talking to my mom because she you know, she's got a hearing issue. But I'm usually just trying to shop and I'm pretty quiet about things. I'll get excited about stuff, but I won't make a lot of noise and stuff. Like if I find something, I'll get happy. But like they knew I don't usually cause any problems in the Walmart. This guy did. It was creepy.
sadly, they, I've seen this kind of behavior before and stuff. I watched a guy. Does anyone remember when My Little Pony was just getting popular? And, like, bronies were just becoming a thing? So, and I remember this. This is probably the funniest thing I've ever seen. So when My Little Pony was just getting popular, they had, um... They had, uh, what was it? Um, they had, like, McDonald's figures, right? This dude lost his damn mind, because we were in the drive-thru. And this guy got so mad that, and I will never forget this, he got mad he got Pinkie Pie and not Rainbow Dash. That he, and I'm not joking, I wish I had filmed this, he got out of his car and cl tried to climb into the window of the um, drive-thru, demanding he gets his Rainbow Dash. Like, it was... Like, everybody in the cars behind him were just watching this. Like, he would, like... It's like, dude, just ask them for a different toy. Like, I don't know why people do this shit. Like, I'm not saying all bronies did that shit, because I know bronies who are completely sensible, but that shit was funny. I feel bad for the, for the drive-thru person, they were scared too. Every group in fandom has their good and bad. Yeah, exactly. You have psychos in every, in, you know, all groups. It's just the, the bad ones always are the loudest. But it was one of those where you just kind of watch the shit show happen, and you watch the police have to, the cops had to drag him out of the, he got stuck. The cops had to get him out. So they were just starting, like, because again, he was stuck. They had to start bringing people their orders. It's not funny! I swear to god, it wasn't- it was fucking hysterical, I'm not lying, it's, it's funny you shit to see that. Dude really liked his Pinkie Pie. Or no, uh, Rainbow Dash, I'm sorry. He didn't like Pinkie Pie. Now, I could- I, I- I don't imagine going that nuts, even with the stuff that I'm a diehard fan of, I couldn't imagine going that nuts. Like, even when I go and get stuff. Um, when I want to go look for something. Because I've looked for Ninja Turtle stuff and things like that. If they don't have it, I get a little sad and I move on, and I'll go look at another store. Like, that's the most sensible thing to do. I can't imagine going absolutely psycho. Or if, some, like I said, somebody else grabs the last one. You get sad and you move on, or you say, hey, if you don't want that, I'll take it. That's all you gotta do. I don't know why people don't do that anymore. I wish I had filmed it, I really do. Because that, that is actually pretty close to it, Ham. He was just stuck there, half hanging out. And the poor drive through people were, like, trying to push him out of it, and he wouldn't leave. Like, he was going nuts. They had to call the cops. Crashing even off screen. Oh, I can shoot these. Or not that one, I guess. Yeah, it was, it was completely nuts. Like, I've seen Florida is insane. I will say that. Um, but I think the Walmart thing was the worst. Just because I... Again, dude, just, just ask me for it. If you would've asked for it, that dude would've gotten it. And then I just bought it because of you. But, of course. I'm yelling everyone. Put your day and month of birth in Google and type Florida Man. Oh, I've done that before. I am not single. I fucking said it. Why does this person keep asking if I'm single? I've said it. I, I, I am dating weaponized nerd rage. He will confirm it if nobody believes me. We are rather happy in our little relationship. That's why occasionally I show up on his streams. That and we both like, you know, similar movies and stuff. Which we just watched, um, we just did, um, a movie night and we watched some, uh, an Italian, uh, Giallo. Which is, uh, basically a, um, Italian, like, noir mystery. Which is very good. Which one did we watch? We watched, uh, Argento one. Wait, can I get that? Let's find out. Spiky! Fuck yeah! Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, that is actually horrifying. 
What the fuck are you? Oh, that is horrifying. That is horrifying. I am the most horrifying sea urchin that there is. Run, bitch, run. Kirby's just going full on this time. No chill. Everything comes with him. Is that a Yoshi enemy? All girls are taken. Yes, Chris Chan, all girls are taken. I am sorry, I've been in a relationship for a while now. I'm not about to dump him. And I have had people ask me to dump my boyfriend for them. I'm sorry, thank you for being a fan. And I've said this before to people, and I feel bad for saying it. Very little chance. There'd be very little chance. I, I am very happy. The rock bird. Guarding him? You're doing a good job of guarding him, buddy. You keep guarding. Virgin for life. You gotta do you gotta do the whole thing about being a virgin with rage though. That's how you gotta do it. Dude, if you're looking for a girlfriend just for sex, that is actually not you're not gonna find a girl at all. Just go get a hooker and be done with it. I'm 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 actually giving you some good like anyone that thinks that getting a girlfriend and having to get sex and stuff, it's not a good idea. Come on. You can do this, Kirby. Come on. There you go, buddy. You got there in the end. Women generally don't find their attractive. Yeah, no, that is true. It is really creepy. Like, I, 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 I should say I'm honored that people want to date me just because of my voice and my attitude. But I am much happier dating somebody who likes me for me that knows me. If that makes sense. It's, I, I, I know what I said sounded stupid. In my brain, I made some kind of sense. I still think it's funnier that my, uh, my ex is the one that introduced me to my boyfriend. <laughs> and I'm never letting him live that down. Been married 10 plus years. Congratulations, Ham! Man, that is not easy. I give you some major credit for that. Web's supposed to be coming to the con that I'm going to in uh, June. I'm pretty excited for that one. So we don't we we live in the same state. We just don't live that close to each other. We're a couple hours away from each other. I'm gonna explore a little. I know it said to go to the burger place, but I want to explore. Escalator, go up. Yet to. Go to a single convention. Oh, you should. They are really fun. It's exhausting, but it's like that fun kind of exhausting going to a con, in my opinion. Like, I love it. I love going to cons. It's the only time that I'm really open and um, I try to be more social because I feel like I can. What the happened to you? Wow. You poor bastard. You're not cute anymore. You used to kind of be cute. Harmless. Ow! In the corner. 
That was my answer. Give me your ice powers. Is that Poochie? I forgot what the Ice Walrus's name is. I love the Ice Power in Kirby games. Because of the slight the the ice skating. gone now. Does it come back? Nope. I will be doing, uh, will you do, yes, I am going to be doing Divine Adventure, the new update. Um, the devs are actually patrons of mine, and they, um, they sent it to me a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I've just been concentrating on two games at a time. So I'll take a break from Slootcraft to play it. Uh, because I do want to finish the game. I really love the story. And they, uh, they were nice enough to send their condolences for the death I had in the family. So they are really great devs. If you guys, really quick, if you guys haven't checked out Masquerade Games' is, uh, Patreon, they are some fantastic developers. Go give them some love. They're working really hard to make the game that everyone can enjoy. And I love them for it. Bye. So I will be doing that. I'm gonna do... Probably another week or two of Slootcraft and then just take a small... No, I'm going to make that that game for a little while Patreon exclusive and I'm going to um, do Divine Adventure. So I do have a plan. I just... I, I have a plan. I'm just going to figure it out on my own. Because I'm spaz. Come here! I can fly, you fucker. Thing is, if you're really going on YouTube and Twitch looking for a girlfriend or a fuck buddy, people go on Pornhub looking for that too. It's weird. And OnlyFans. I've had quite a few weird con um, DMs on OnlyFans. I don't mind when people want me to degrade them and they pay me extra for that in audio form. That is a very big thing, by the way. Um, but it is really weird when I've gotten a couple, more than a couple people going, um, so like, will you, um, you like, Dump your boyfriend for me? If, if I, like, pay you enough money? No. No, no, I won't. Because, uh, you don't date someone for money. You, you tend to date someone because you like them. I mean, you can give me your money. <laughs> I don't mind that, but I don't want to date you, I'm sorry. But yeah, no, I've actually gotten messages like that. It's weird. Pornhub, I've gotten a lot of messages like that. That and people thinking... Another really fun one is people think I'm actually, um... People think I'm, uh, actually in real life a slut, and I don't understand that just because of the games I play. I never really understood that correlation. I don't like talking about this during Kirby. I'm just saying, guys, I'm not... I just play the video games, okay? You know, I'm, I'm not the type that wouldn't be loyal. So. Wouldn't that just mean you would, in theory, just dump them for someone who pays even more? Yeah, theoretically, Tenchi, that is exactly what you're saying. That is exactly what they... They don't think that kind of thing through. And I actually feel bad for guys... Like, I know there are guys who get off on giving people... Giving women money. Like, I don't... I don't... Like, that, that's, it's your thing if you get off on that. But, like... I've never understood guys that actually think 
And I feel bad for guys that think if they give enough money that they're gonna, you know, get a girlfriend that's gonna stay with them. I actually do feel bad for guys like that. Okay, so we wanna go for face cream. Stop corrupting it or else. I mean, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll talk about something else. I don't mind. So I want to know what happened to humans at the uh, in this world. I've never understood people that, that try to get girls at nightclubs either. Then again, I'm not a nightclub person, so that might be it. I really don't like nightclubs, or like, not really a social person. <laughs> I'm kind of shy in real life. At least I think I am. I'm out of here. Nobody likes raw. She just plays games. Yeah, that's basically it. I just like playing video games. And you know what? The fact that people enjoy watching me, be it a sexual game or be it something like this, that makes me happy. That's all I want to do is entertain people. And I want to write my comic. That's the other thing is I want to be able to afford to write and, draw and get the comic drawn. Come on, you can do it, Kirby. Uh, Kirby? Well, this is gonna hurt you, Kirby. Ooh. Poor Kirby. He's gotta have such a headache. My poor little Kirby curb. Ooh, I like should get some help before I go for that. I'm gonna go for gun. I feel like if he's here, I'm gonna need it. Oh, I forgot to eat more donuts. I'm gonna have to come back and play some of these levels. <laughs> oh, man. All humans die because women stop dating men. <laughs> I like that. series of combos to have during Kirby. You go, Waddledees, you go! They're like little Pikmin. Brawl at the mall. Yeah. Always remember, guys, I am the type of woman who has gotten dumped because apparently I would not be a good mother. And that is always going to be the funniest way I've ever been dumped. That and the guy that cheated on me and uh, tried to bring his ex around. That one was funny, too. But no, that, that, that is a real way I've been dumped. He's so fucking dumb. <laughs> yes, and the best part is, um, Force knows who I'm talking about, too. Yes, I actually got dumped, and the reason was because the guy thought I wouldn't be a good mother to his children. And my response is, who the fuck said we were going to have kids? It was weird, and we had been dating for quite a few years, too. Like, it wasn't it wasn't just, um... Dying of fire. Um, it wasn't like it was just a short relationship. It had been one that we'd been having, we were in for quite a while. Got it. Oof, I didn't think I'd get that one. These guys are annoying. I may not be able to get this one. Yes, I got that! 
Oh, I didn't think I'd get it. Woo! I didn't think I would get this one. Woohoo! Oh, a gun raffle sounds fun. We have uh, actually where I live now, they have quite a lot of gun con like um like the convention gun things. <laughs> Jolly Rancher should sponsor Kirby. Just keep on sucking. That would that would be a good marketing campaign actually. You're right. Thank you for the bits. I've seen gun raffles. Around here we have a lot of um convention like gun um You don't call them gun conventions. I forgot what you call them. But it's a gun convention type thing. I've got two guns. I'd like to get a third one eventually. I'd like to get like a shotgun or really a rifle because I'm better shooting a rifle with rifles. I'm gonna. I wonder if gun would be good against the enemy here, the boss here. I guess we'll find out. First time seeing this game, all I see is homicidal maniac murdering everyone and freeing creatures in orange. Must be convicts, breaking criminals out of prison and mass murder to cheerful soundtrack. Welcome Honker Bonker! I love that! That is a great way to think of this game. Also, I love your screen name. That was a per that's a perfect screen name. Makes me think of the old Bonkers cartoon. I'm just sure show you guys where my mind goes. Gun show, thank you. You can see what kind of person I am that I keep thinking, ah, oh, bananas. We're stealing Donkey Kong's bananas, no one tell him. He'll never find out. We stole all of his bananas. Okay. I'm gonna try using gun in there. I'm actually kind of curious how gun will work. Hey, I gotta go to the bathroom. Wait, was Kirby actually going to the bathroom? Wash your hands when you're done, Kirby. That is a big monkey. Hi, monkey. You want to be friends? Want to be friends? Come on, you want to be friends? Hey! Hey, Forrest! It's Scar! You know what I'm talking about. He does not want to be friends. He does not want to be friends. No, he does not. He doesn't like me. Oh, I think I might have just found the way to easy beat this. So gun's really good against this guy. I do like his dang it, I love the way they design characters. Nintendo does really good job with with the uh, character designs. So uh you're Donkey Kong's like cousin that he doesn't talk about, is that who you are? mad I stole your bananas? Because I'll give them back to you. I didn't mean to take them. I didn't even know they were yours. That's nice. Why does no one ask nicely in this world? Wow, that is, that is making him into a joke. So, use gun in this boss fight. It just turns the enemy into a joke. Ah, 
God, you can cheese this guy with the with gun. You spin me right around, baby, right around like a boom. That'll do it. He's itty bitty legs. He skipped leg day. Use gun on him around, baby, because of course. V wasn't on purpose. Mr. T's monkey. game so far. I'm really enjoying it. I hope you guys are too. Gotcha machines and that's where I'm wasting all my money. Gotcha machine volume one is now available. Turn the crank and get a figurine. Try to collect the whole set. Waddle D's weapon shop is now open. Head here to make your copy ability even stronger. shop is open. Looks like a quick way to grab copy abilities. I also heard that Waddle Dee inside knows a secret to growing stronger. Let's pay him a visit. While it despises you playing this, I'm sorry. I was very, very grateful to the person who sent it. I'll probably play this tonight, too. Welcome to Waddle Dee's weapon shop. I work with all types of copy abilities. It's kind of my thing. Oh, that's why they were selling the little figures of them dressed like this. I wish I had grabbed them. Any copy abilities you find out there will become available in here. Pop in and grab one anytime. Oh, and guess what? I can help you evolve those abilities to make them much stronger. There's actually a cute little um, Kirby figure. Um, well, it's a statue of him by the uh, end gate. I really want to get that. This blueprint contains some incredible techniques we can use to it to evolve your abilities. Let's try evolving one right now. I'll ready my tools. Give me a second. Thanks for waiting. The cutter ability can now be evolved into the chakram cutter. Thanks for waiting. The fire ability can now be evolved into the volcano fire. To evolve this, okay, and rare stones. You can find rare stones on the treasure treasure roads hidden throughout the world map. Try those out. I prepped everything in advance this time, so we're all set. Alrighty. Holy volcano fire. Success all done. The fire ability is evolved into volcano fire. If you find more blueprints, just bring them to me. I'll use them to evolve your abilities even further. how they're putting so much different stuff into this game it looks like to the chakram cutter looks like it's something from power rangers or uh, sentai warriors how's life doing buddy the cutter ability lets you stop your attack mid-air ooh
Oh, that's cool. Look at that. What's over here? Oh, that's creepy. Can uh, one of my mods take care of the bot and YouTube? By the way, we are on Twitch also. If you guys want to be awesome, you can join in and help me hit 75 viewers. Or just pop out the chat and talk to everybody. You can also, you know, sub or become a member on either YouTube or Twitch. When you're ready to explore more, just hop on to the Warp Star and fly to a new area. so cute. But that does ask, it does make me wonder where is Waddle, where is uh, King Dedede and, and Meta Knight? Let's see what we get. Boofa Horn. Behold, it's the brutal, brutish Boofa Horn. Weak attacks won't stand a chance against this critter's forward tackle. Good thing they have a hard time stopping. If if you're careful, you can trick them into running off cliffs. They'll be okay down there. They're real tough. <laughs> That's a star block. Let's do one more. Ranger! Time for some shooting star sharpshooting. Pew pew! Hold the button and get the thing charged. It's Abomination Kirby! Kirby gained the mysterious mouth mode ability after he flew through the vortex. Now he can stuff an entire car into his mouth. When he does, he turns into a peppy pink car that can jump and also use Turbo Dash. It's a nice day for a scenic drive, so turn up the radio. Alright, we're done. With that, anyway. No, 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 no. Good night.